Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. Been absent for a couple days, honestly, just having a blast with the modding tools. I finally got to the point where, you know, adding things to the game is I'm actually creating content as opposed to, you know, <laughs> tearing out my hair about the lack of design documents. So I got a bit excited about that recently, and um, hence uh, I've been doing a lot of modding instead of gaming, but that will change. If I remember correctly, we have just annihilated Mr. Valent, the androgynous Valentine, <laughs> who I referred to as both Michael and Michelle for some reason, and took all of his cities, encountered a bug where the strategic AI ignored cities, so we have all this territory because purple over here graciously allowed us to take all the territory of Valentine. It'll probably give us a massive edge but you know what what are you gonna do i think in terms of victory conditions we're still not even halfway to domination so i gotta <sighs> more empires must fall was valentine first blood he was so if i remember last game five five guys had to die so these guys they want open borders and they offer energy you know what i'll take that I'm kind of in the I want to expand uh, mood, so I, I, you know, go, you know, while normally we always go to war, um, this is that one time where it's like, well, if we hold back a little bit, we can upgrade our infrastructure, do a bunch of research, have a blast, and a party, all the above. Um, I should actually take stock of my different... I have a lot of Vanguard colonies. One, two, three, six. Like I have like six of these guys. So, yeah, this is where the, the colony manager gets a little bit... It's the, the wrench in the gear of the otherwise glorious uh, casual military... Uh, casual war game that this is. So we have to figure out what cities are actually decent for producing stuff. You know, what do I want to put there? Holy bajoli. Holy heck. What is this? Colony center. Double abandoned quarries. One of which is... We got one here. This is another sector. This is... We can grab that. If I have any robots nearby. Oh, oh wait, I have this one. Uh, this guy can come over here and just grab that. Oh, we're already there! So, that gives us two forest tiles, which is pretty nice. Uh, looks like we're getting... The ability to resurrect our fallen hero. We're going to then get forest exploitation, which allows us to upgrade the production to make even more production. It'd be great. Absolutely phenomenal. So over here, this guy already has an absurd amount of... Um, already has an absurd amount of um, production. So what I think that means... And we already have all the buildings. Wow. Uh, drop the science. This is looking like a pretty solid place. We'll get that going. Why not? Uh, this one is becoming basic food. What are you? And what are you doing? Well, that's taken care of. I don't even have to worry about that. That's ours in a turn. That's ours in another turn. So the other thing to start thinking about is to make colonizers. Do I have any place that can build something? Oh, that guy's changing that. If I rush this, it's 22 energy. Let's do a colonizer. Um, I 
why can I annex that? Oh, that's hilarious. It's um, it's technically uh, adjacent to this place down here. Um. Oof. Well, I kind of want to grab more territory around here. This, actually, this colony here can grab both of these. So really, this is our only option. How far are we away from 50? Okay. Um... What do I want? Do I want tier 3 units from you? Might not be a bad idea. Uh, what are we researching? We're researching disassemblers. Then I think we want probably this. So it'll take, I think, a total of eight turns. Um. Combat implants, 10% accuracy, and crit hit. Let's get a heavy soldier. Why not? It is the big bad man. I am Dr. Destruction. That's great. So these guys will start a new army. I have an army. Can I upgrade you to the best of your abilities? think so. What are you going to do? Um, or honestly it makes a lot more sense to grab this stuff. So we'll send a full army out here to grab more territory. This is a level up. This should be a pretty, pretty one-sided battle. But it is time to deploy the exterminators. So what is going on in this battle? We've got modded zappy boys and flamey boys. Mark of the dark sun. Yikes. Okay, so if they actually kill something, they'll get worse. They have a bunch of resistance to physical damage. And what do you have? Okay, so can make things on fire. And both of them have Mark of the Dark Sun because they're evil space rocks and they must be destroyed. So we got this guy who can try to grab a bunch of great lines of sight over here. That'll be useful. Um, I don't actually want to use this guy's ability because it'll just get chained. Uh, we can set this guy up to teleport in and do lots of fun things next turn. So he's going to run all the way forward. This guy is going to run out on the flank again. Um, and again, we want to be at least two spaces apart on all our units. So that way they don't get those chain attacks off. This guy we could run them like way all the way back here. Or all the way over here even. Let's do that. We got the far flank. It's like a regular flank, but further. Oh, they are tickling me. Ah, it tickles. So this is our bullet bender that can do lots of horrible things. Now these guys, I think, get a double stagger going. I'm kind of into that, so let's do it. Um, we're going to try to kill this, and I can do a melee swing on him for 5 whopping damage. That's a 50% chance, I'm not liking it. I get closer, that's a lot better. Ooh. Alright, then we're going to come in, this guy has 50 HP, what is his hit chance here. 45 or we'll rock over and punch him in the face. Let's do it. Enemy Ooh. eliminated. 
That's what I like to hear. This guy, I think, can get all the way in here. So that's basically... He's under control. And... Um... That guy should get interrupted. Let's come all the way over here. Boom. Enemy annihilated. Oh no. Can we heal him? Is that the heal? It is the heal. And oh that's enemy terminated. That's what it sounds like when you are about to die and no one is there to salute you. Enemy terminated. The assembly march on. Okay. So I think we should have gotten a level for that, but well, we're gonna see who's occupying that. Um, on this front, did I claim the territory already? Yes, so this is no longer a thing. Uh, I guess we'll, we already have one over here. Why is it taking forever to... Oh, because we disassembled that. Um, that's probably what we want to do. It's our main city. Eight turns over here. Um, I could pump food into other cities, but I think we're going to wait on that. I'm actually kind of amazed this hasn't grown yet. But that's because it has all of the, the, the production. It's a stinky dwarf. Oh, someone took energy siphon. Systems infiltrated. Systems infiltrated. God damn. So everyone's taking all of our money, and we didn't even notice. <laughs> Interesting. There's some attacking dudes that I'm not too worried about. Um, so, we're about to hit like an energy capitulation or whatever because our morale bonuses are gonna disappear. So, you know, do you wanna? Let's do that. Okay. Uh, we'll have to declare war on someone, so we have the, the morale to <laughs> continue this war. <laughs> ah. Oh, you want to give us money, too. Thank you. That's great. <laughs> so, they're so ashamed by the fact they were just asked, you know, they declared war on us, and they want to they wanna say sorry in a very meaningful way. So they're going to give us an extra 200 money, which I think we can just turn into literally another colonizer. Um, where do I want to send this thing? Probably over here. Do I have an army that can clear this nonsense out? Most definitely. So these guys are going to send... Uh, I think that's fine. We'll head over here. This is a Patagon. So we want to make them... Sure, actually. Why not? Um, can I build another colonizer here? I need... 60 Cosmite. Um, let's do that then. Why not? Has the unexploited sectors. 
So, what do we have? What did I just grab here? Um, it's this one. Do more science. Uh, this is ruins, right? No, it's a forest. But that's ruins. So let's do... Um, do I want to do double energy? Uh, kind of do. If we're gonna go for the um, the energy sector stuff, oh, I already upgraded that. That is rough. I don't think it matters a whole lot, to be honest. <laughs> like we're not gonna get tier four or whatever. Um, we're not gonna get super high tech uh, energy sectors, but even if they get to tier three, they'll be phenomenal. Over here, what do we have? We have production land. Welcome to uh, production land. Uh, I think I could get a decent amount of food out of this place. Um, but energy is just so good, like. Hmm, let's just do energy. I think if I was going to grab food for a place, it would be here. Um, but that bridge is on fire. It is burning! The bio farm going. Uh, this is going to expand in a turn. What are we going to grab with this colony? Uh, we can grab these sectors. So this guy is going to head all the way over here and wait a turn. Um, not a whole lot. What, what do you do in life? Oh, there's that. Yeah, we should take care of that. <laughs> this is trying to be an energy sector. Uh, we even upgraded all that. So, you have a central biofarm. You're producing very decent amounts of energy. And we have a tier 3. So that would give us plus 10% energy, which is nice. We're going to do that. I think that's coming from our mountain upgrade. So we're getting more energy! Which is great. This is where like the game just slows down to a grinding halt. Do you want to upgrade this? What about this? How about that? I'm looking forward to the next expansion because there's um... What is it? There's these like anomaly things which are... Uh, places of interest that you can visit and um... I don't know, they're like events combined with uh, structures, if you would. If you played like the was it, Total War Warhammer thing, it's kind of like um, the uh, exploring sites before you colonize them, but actually good and efficient, ideally, as opposed to just saying this thing that you don't do because colonizing is just better. <laughs> uh, let's see. What do I even want to do with these guys? Where are our armies? We've got three stacks over here. We've got two stacks here. Ah, uh, we've got a stack over here. These guys are unhappy, apparently. Granted, I would be too if I had my butt handed to me as, much, as hard as it was to those guys. So that leaves these guys. Um, I guess we're going to hang out at our capital and see what happens. All this area, see, like, all this stuff should be colonized, but I don't think it is because of the, uh, the colonizer changes, which is a bit weird. Um, might as well 
upgrade that. You have two food exploitations. Um, that's not terrible. And I can grab more territory. What can I do? Super purple nice guys. Uh, let's do... And let's give you... I will give you a hundred space bucks. There we go. So let's grab this. Oh. Uh. It's the other purple people. Uh, could we... Oh. Hmm. Okay. Hey, we don't want to kill each other. That's great. Let's do this, and we'll even give you... that. Okay, so I sent a gift to the other guys for literally no reason. But, you know, it's all good. It's absolutely grand. It's great, you might even say, to supportive. Yeah, we're losing our. losing all our support. Um. So at this point, we're going to try to explore the map, um, just kind of build up our territory. Really, I want to become buddies with the, the Paragon guys. I have wronged you. Okay. The dwarves have been wronged, said no one ever. <laughs> oh, man. I also have to build a bunch of nonsense. I don't think we can expand yet, so we'll just hang out. Uh, let's make sure it's safe. Looks like there's an army that we can slaughter. Uh, let's manual it, just in case. That's a lot of stinky boys. So, what do these guys have? Carrying a plague. Six bio damage at the end of its unit's turn with some blight plague that's super not cool. Two resistances to all status effects. You're the same shit. What do you have? Melee attacks, poison. Alright, so they're stinky smelly people and they wanna spread their they wanna spread their stink to us as well. Since they're all melee come up here and we overwatch um, I am going to kind of be a little careful with the placement of these guys oh by careful I mean run my range unit straight into battle <laughs> um, we're really grouped up over here I hope we don't die for it Oh, he got shot. Operations ready. Okay, so this is where we try to gun everything down. Uh, that is not gunning everything down. That is called missing. So my biggest issue are going to be these flyers. Okay. Enemy annihilated. We got a stagger, which is great. Uh, this guy can kind of get in the way of these guys. And stagger them. It's also great. You can also TP on them, I think, right? Oh, no, I can't. Uh, unfortunate. Do I have a shotgun? I do. 50% chance at something. That's 
decent. How much is that going to eat? Not a whole lot. Not enough to worry about it. Um, so we're going to hope. Yeah, that's great. Unit offline. Heal my pointless units. And then you will see the master plan. Enemy destroyed. Which is shooting you from behind. Enemy down. Uh, what do I even want? What do I even want in life? Oh, I forgot to melee. Enemy destroyed. Hey, they did something. Our forces are victorious. Okay. These guys are moving. They're motoring, if you would. This, I think we're grabbing for Hive X. Yeah. Oh, wasn't there something I... Mm. Was there something I wanted to do? That's the dangerous question. <laughs> Uh, I do not want to trespass. I want to say hello. How are you doing? So there's all this unclaimed territory out here. I guess it's like five colonies worth of territory out here. It is pretty nuts. And we have tons of population. Or not population. Um... We have tons of uh, energy and cosmite to build more colonizers. Because that is what we do in life. We will build more colonizers. Um, over here. What are you? We do not have a whole lot of science income over here. So let's start that guys are unhappy in life and we do have to do an exploitation we've got food Wait, why do we have food there's a perfectly nice energy production over there um, so we will dismantle that and then next turn we will turn that into an energy place because why not Tronton. What do you even want to do in life? Let's just. Operations available for priming. Alright, we can bring someone back. That'll be great. Oh no. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. Yeah. Okay. You need to head over here. I can afford that. Now we can get rid of that. Perfect. I remembered. A giant stink cloud is causing problems. Yeah, we also need to just build up our economy somehow, because there's no way that our stacks are going to defend this, all of this territory. <laughs> we need like triple the armies. It's kind of nuts. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. We got the disassembler. Um... guy will come back here, chill. Okay, so that's looking clear. Uh, where's our colonizer? It's right over here. And do the colony thing. Um, I think we're going to also ask you guys to leave. Get the energy and then see what's over here. Uh, 
about that. I don't want to enter. Maybe start looking at all the territory. Uh, this. That's the edge of the map. Might as well go over here. Where does this go? Okay. Not very far. And this guy can probably head over there. We have another colonizer. Um, so this is definitely going to grab one, two, one, two, three, four, five maybe? That leaves this, but that's okay. So I could easily send this like here. Uh, if we could get that, that'd be nice. But there's all this stuff here too. Well, I think at the very least we'll, s we'll send it here so that way we can grab this and this without provoking anything. It'll be great. I don't have the Cosmite to build another one, um, but let's see. So we're going to get a Fanatic. These guys costed a pretty penny. Um, do I want like two of these? I think we could go with like a Fanatic, um, probably a main support. So, Fnatic, a main support, um, maybe some sort of like range superiority, uh, definitely reactive shielding. I think we're going to hold off a little bit until we get our explosive rounds. I want these guys to be like ranged, um, what is it, ranged artillery, uh, because they have a pretty solid gun. How much better is that than, like, the soldiers? I think... What do the soldiers do? Oh, they actually... They're better. Oh, that's probably because of the bop. Um, they do slightly less... Slightly less damage. Well, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Why does their heavy repeater only do slightly more damage? I won't. I guess I, I'll. I'll find out later. <laughs> uh, so these guys are going to wait over here. This is on the front lines in Sick Bakhtin. What are we doing? All right, I want it an energy exploitation here. That is the luxury glasslands, which we want energy exploitation. The glintwood could be whatever we want it to be. Um, I would kind of want another um, production area, so we'll do that here. This is pretty much a. can build something here. Um, you're growing in a turn. Um, we've got an energy plant. Probably a nice place to put another energy sector. Oh wait, I can't colonize this, can I? No, I cannot. But there's, another, there's a great energy sector over there, actually. Let's see, is there anything occupying that? No! Perfect. So we'll, we'll be here next turn. So because of that, I want... Oh, do I already have all the, all the like... No, I don't. Oh, that's the only mountain sector we have. Okay, I, I can deal with that. Um, let's grab... Make people happy. Provenbor. This was the double food sector. Um, I think we'll do energy. I need so much energy because, you know, look at all the territory. <laughs> it's like, oh my god, that's so much territory. It's so big! <laughs> 
so we'll have to figure that out. That one's being cleaned up. Are there any more triangles causing us unhappiness problems? I do not see any more triangles. I see lots of <laughs> see lots of rhombuses, but nothing else. You're gonna demand stuff from me, fine. Uh, growth faction. Not really going to do that. These guys are heading up here. The new city, new cities built. Central Biofarms. It's a rule. Look it up. Um, it's going to get 46 to leave, so we're going to ask them to leave next turn. Uh, these guys are coming over here to grab territory when we need to. Uh, I guess we're looking at what's over here. Um, holy cow. I don't know how my economy is fluctuating by that much. I guess it's just once they produce something, they produce a boatload of energy. Uh, so we are going to get... We're going to get the uh, fanatic from that quest. Um, it's going to be... A, probably be too long to get another paragon unit so I think I want to focus on range we're gonna do is the electrocutioners because the um, paragon fanatic can upgrade this unit to fire lightning bolts of massive destruction so I want to support that with a couple with a couple backline units like the electrocutioner on this front I think we're getting to a point where we've explored a decent amount. We can come over here and see if there's something over here, but I'm not, not holding out for it. This is our super energy sector, ready to pump out all of the energy. It'd be great. Is there any place that's going to upgrade anytime soon? Not really, so we'll just send this guy back here. God, I can't wait to never have to do that ever again. <laughs> I am looking forward to the upcoming patch. It'll be great. Uh, we could upgrade our energy stuff. This is our super production area, but let's grab some of that. Uh, and efficient assembly line. That'll also be pretty important. Let's go back over here. We've got double energy sectors. Oh, I didn't even realize this was a production thing. I've just been ignoring it this entire time. I'm the best at everything. Um, We can do optimization control. Actually, no, we won't. We want happiness. Let's buy some happiness. Look at all that energy. It's a lot of energy. These guys are unhappy. And they're going to have a problem in a very long time. But we'll fix it now. Uh, Hive X, what do you want to do in life? Uh, this could be really anything. Want to just do food? This has a food sector. It could also be energy. We have a lot of mountainous stuff over here. So why not? We already have double energy. Okay then. Um, let's just make it food. Grow stronger. Faster. Oh, actually, you're unhappy. Everybody's unhappy. Let's just... Everyone's gonna get a guard. You get a guard. And you get a guard! What do you want? Um, uh, None of these actually have exploitations, because I'm a master strategic dude. Do I want more science? You know what? We can do some science. What's the worst thing... What's the worst that could happen if we do some science? Um... Hmm. 
kind of seeing some production potential because of all these forests. So let's do some production up here. I guess eventually we're going to want to probably take, o take care of that. Oh, they can set up little bases. That's pretty cool. I'm paving the way to world domination. Incoming communication. There's nothing between us. Oh, I'm I'm crushed. <laughs> it's the best time, like best type of you know world leader negotiation. You just sit down. There is nothing between us, and I am okay with that. Like, how do you respond to that? You know, do you, do you try to, like, <laughs> warm him up with some, Objective completed. you know, compliment? Got a fanatic. Hallelujah. We got energy development, too. It's even better. So this is where we can upgrade all the energy colonies because it is fun. But that'll happen sometime in the future. And now, let's see, we've got... A backliner, kind of a tanky unit. Uh, let's do double backliner. That sounds fun. Oh my gosh, could we actually afford another colonizer? That might be a thing. Where would I even put it? Hmm. Right, I think that's where we want this to go. So let's do that. We could put one there. There is so much territory over here. I could even, like, put one all the way over here. But as soon as I want to... As soon as I want to grow, I'm going to butt heads. And then there's all this stuff over here. And this is also unclaimed. Uh, did I make a horrible mistake and not grab this when I could have? Um, Probably. So how much is it for a colonizer? 70. So we're going to try to do that next turn. Unexploited sector. Uh, looks like that's an energy sector, buddy. These guys going to run over here. Uh, we're using up our movement points over here for some reason. So that's that. Do I care about the science? Probably. How much will it cost to get you out of here? 22. Let's do it. So I, I want some armies on this front. Because it's just so far away. So actually, you guys are going to head up north. Um... I think we actually want to head both these armies over here. Um, we'll see what we want to do with that later. Operations primed and ready. So this was our melee guy who lost his gun. We give you a better weapon. Not really. We have a sword glaive. Inferno fist. These do 13 damage, these do 12 damage, so a little bit more damage. I kind of want more damage. Um, so we get some damage, we can give you reactive shielding, which keeps you from getting focused. And maybe a grenade, let's do that. Or I could build a colonizer. Well, I'm gonna forget about this guy. That's that's the thing. Like, if I if I don't do anything right now, he's he's gonna have he's gonna go into combat with his bare hands. <laughs> so let's take care of that now. Uh, we've got double melee. Uh, I probably should mod up all this nonsense. Uh, we're actually waiting for basically two turns. So I think that's fine. Uh, that's all 
an area that I can't see. Uh, I guess I could ask for open borders. Okay, can I get open borders with you? Okay, let's use that to explore. So that means we can look at all that guy's territory. Uh, this is our super production zone. Uh, colonizer 70. We should be able to afford one of those next turn. Um, I think we're going to do that. Tronton. Uh, what do you want in life? Energy, food. Research. When in doubt, you always build energy. This is our... What is this, actually? Got everything, because I couldn't decide really anything. <laughs> uh, let's get you some gardens. Incoming communication. What's the point of this message? I have no intention to speak with you. Our relations need not worsen further. Didn't you just worsen the relationships by speaking to me? Okay, unhappiness. Oh, we have too much energy. It's all going to get siphoned away. Um, can I like rush this for like 5 billion energy? And upgrade. I think that's something we could do. What else could I rush? They're all building energy things. You guys are generating energy. How dare you? Uh, oh. I did not realize you were having that many issues. Okay. Well, of all the cities, I feel like there should be like more FX rather than, you know, it looks like, because most of the time it's like, oh yeah, you could do something in 30 turns. So Covenberg, this place, Get some botanical gardens, right? We're not riding in the streets yet. We're not focused on anything. Let's pump up the production. Pump it up. Why do I have 5 billion slots? It's because of this thing, isn't it? Okay. This is also open. There's so much open territory. Holy cow. We could take everything. Not just nothing, but everything. Uh, do I want to do something for you guys? Not really. Do I want a level 10 Amazon melee lady? Uh, that's rough. Uh, we'll go with something else. 
I don't think I want an actually that could have been another like full tier pilot. What was I thinking? I don't know. Uh, we don't want you to go in the stack. We want you to head over there. The guys can expand, so we're gonna grab that. And then head back over here. Uh, let's just work on the happiness. Holy cow. Happiness event. That's what's happening. They're making lots of babies. You're heading to the front line. And I can explore into their territory, so that's exactly what I'm doing. Exploring all their territory. What is over here? There's some unhappy people and another paragon spot. We could try to grab these guys. Oh my god, we really need to grab that. Oh my gosh. Uh, this guy has... How are we doing slot-wise? We could always add more... More people. That's probably worth it. So let's do the upgrade. Uh, these guys could also move out to this front line area. We have enough for a colonizer. I think I want to build one at a different place. This, these guys still haven't gotten their last sector yet. So, new army. Um, let's just keep going. You need to grow. What do you need in life? Um. Why is there a food sector over here? Did I really build this? Am I that dumb? Um, do I care that much about plus five energy? Uh, I, probably not. Not anymore. <laughs> so, let's see. This grows in a couple turns. We can grab one of these. Um, lots of mountain sectors. Or at least there are two mountain sectors and I definitely want to grab that so let's do wind farms and the energy so why not these guys apparently can annex something hmm. this can come down here I guess grab that next turn building anyway so it doesn't matter Uh, Yuri, Frankie, whatever. Hey, it's Frankie! And he's all the way over here, and he can't do anything. Looks like he's at war with five billion people. Okay. Uh. Can't build a colonizer, because I need, like, how much? Just a little cosmate. So... My exalted buddies, if I asked you for 20 Cosmite, and I balanced that trade offer and then said, you know, let me give you something extra. Oh, baby, you're too kind. So let's get another one of these guys going and send them off into the unknown. We're going to send them over here. Take all the territory. Because we need more. And more! So this is where I would love the anomalies, where like my, my armies could clear them. I think these silver sectors are still... I haven't really been building tier 3 units, so they're kind of off limits where they... Like the Seda Sanctum! Uh, what else do I have access to? I have access to a gold tier, which I can't beat. And another gold tier over here. What does this give me? A bunch of science. This is super good. This is going to be fantastic, actually. Trade all the cause belly 
for 15 Cosmite. Absolutely. Hey, we can do some military research. Um, we can supercharge units. That's pretty cool. Percent chance at bleeding. Uh, what else do we get? Oh, that's so nice. That's really crazy. Um, the other thing is now that we have all this Vanguard infrastructure, I should really just start researching their stuff. Like, that's going to be super useful. Uh, cyborgs trying to eat your face with jump packs. That's going to be great. And, um... Well, we'll stick with that for now. Alright. Message from the Patagon Faction! Uh, we can complete that in almost two turns. I will take that. So we're getting pretty close. How many more relations do I need? To be friends. 25. Okay. Still a long ways off. How much does integration cost? Like what? 85? Operations available for priming. Is there a, uh... Items bought from dwellings cost 20% less. Um, maybe that would have been worth it. Just maybe. Perhaps. Let's see, what do I want? Well, we got the Cosmite. I definitely want that. Um... We can also grab both of these mountain sectors for some mad energy, so well, let's do that. Our movement. You guys are coming over here to hang out. You guys are doing the same thing. These guys can grab a sector, right? One, two... I think I grabbed that for this one, so we'll have to add this to some other place, which is fine. Um, I think we're going to come back here, regenerative patches, we should sell all that. Oh no, this is fully expanded already. So this is getting that sector. I got it. Okay, and you. Uh, we could just put it over here. I don't think anyone has a claim here. I could also go all the way over here. This is probably better. So we're going to head on over. Um, let's do the eco-sustainable stuff. Get all this production upgraded. It'll be great. Speaking of which, I can also upgrade all of that. And this. And you guys. There's so much stuff to build. Holy cow. And you're super unhappy. Why are you so unhappy? Uh, doesn't look like there's any good reason. You're just, just really pissed off at life. Okay. Where we are with our armies. We've got two on this front here. Don't have anything up here. That's something to think about. 
We've got some over here, and we've got a core set over here. Those guys are heading out. I just need so much more. Okay, and then everybody's... Incoming communication. Um... I don't even know. I guess I really want to get my colonies going, so I should focus on being friends with everybody, right? How are we doing? Still got 20 more. I think actually I'm getting close to my limit. If I start building, if I build any more colonizers, um, I think we're going to hit, we're going to go over that threshold. Looks like a lot of stuff. Hey, we did a thing. So, stuff is happening. We're almost to the point where we can grab, uh, what is it, some Paragon dwellings. Maybe even two of them, depending on what happens over here. I don't really know what I want to go to war against, but war is definitely going to happen soon. Um, so... Oh, we'll see what happens. Well, this is the precipice uh, before we're at total war. Should be great, fun, enjoyable even. Catch you then.